Just starting to ride. 37 mile ride. There's a Mississippi River. How we doing? How good. My chain just fell off. Oh my. I've caught up to the peloton immediately. I think we ought to call that holy shit hill, huh? That's exactly what I said. Jesus. Around on your left. Thanks, sir. On your left. Close, oh no. What will I do now? Well, if I hadn't said my goal today, and I've worked for it all my life, I worked for it hard, and I deserve this. But, but my goal today in this gravel bike race, the cannonball, my goal is to come in last place. Uh, so far I'm not doing too well. I passed a few people. Well, I'm eight miles in. Been a lot of ups. Not too many downs. According to the sign there, it's down. <laughs>
my bike back. Piney Creek area and this is one bad ass hill but I'm one bad ass mountain biker man that was steep a steep hill and not only is it steep it's long I think I've been climbing from well, probably about a half a mile what's over the hill What a nice road. Man, how beautiful is this? Well, if we drop down on to Route 3, that's right where I ran across the gate grass there and through the ditch. And I didn't go down the road very far and I was climbing back up the ridge line. I've surely ridden this on my motorcycle, but I just don't remember it. But. I think it's time for a break. Yeah, we'll let my Yamaha motor cool off. Besides that, I got a pee. scare me none just watch this hold my beer while you're at it well the road ain't really closed but this bridge goes over the Mary River near Chester Illinois uh, and it's the same river that uh, that old covered bridge goes over which it's around that way, but this area does flood here. Believe it or not, it gets up, it gets up over the road. And I've been down there on my motorcycle when it was. So uh, 
It came a heck of a rain around here the other day. It was predicted to four or five inches, and they probably put them signs up, but uh, it, the, road, the water never really got that deep to close the road, but they had, looks like they still got the signs out. Anyway, I'm about uh, five miles from the end of my ride, and what a good time I have had today. I dressed just perfect, my uh, temperature-wise, because it was it froze last night. And uh, me and Debbie and Dee Dee got in my van and drove to uh, Chester, Illinois and ate at Owls over in Missouri and had a really nice breakfast. Then I went for the ride. You know, you gotta, you gotta enjoy uh, these few days left of nice weather. It's, it's supposed to get really, really, really cold tomorrow. We'll be in the 20s tomorrow night, I think. So I'm tickled to death. My uh, high bike 47 S Duro 27 half inch wheels uh, full suspension e-bike is, uh, I'm not bragging, I'm just telling you what it is. It's done fine. I just bought this Garmin 750T GPS. I was flabbergasted. This thing does, uh, it's a little, it does all the stuff that my big ones do. I wouldn't put it on my motorcycles because the screen's too small. But it's, my other ones are too big for a bicycle. So this has been awesome. Trick computer says I uh, went 32 miles. Gee, gee. Smell the finish line. Looks like I'm in second place. If I could pass this guy, I'll be in first place. Hey, I'm in second place. <laughs> no. All the way through. Alrighty. We're looking good. Alrighty. Got my number? Uh, 279. Hey, first log down on the other side of the road. 